What is going on guys? Today we have got Pez 2019. I'm going to be starting a Master League series, so we're going to get straight into that. Uh, before we do a few things guys, massive shout out to Wolfie for this thumbnail. He's created this, he'll create the one for my Manchester United career mode series in FIFA. If you're wondering about career modes, uh, yeah, that will be coming uh, soon uh, when the early access comes out for FIFA. But I'm really excited to get into Pez 2019 uh, with this Master League series. I haven't played Master League really for a couple seasons now in Pez, but I'm really excited to give Pez 2019 a go. You know how it is with FIFA. Yeah, career mode doesn't look like it has so many new changes. So I'm excited to start a Master League series, but massive shout out to Wolfie for the thumbnail. Great work to him and also he's made a lot of thumbnails for me so yeah massive thank you to him uh yeah check him out i'll leave his links in the description and also i've got all the updates people stay away from pez because of the licenses i've got all the real names kits logos everything it's all looking good uh from uh, pez universe uh, got it from them. Amazing. I'll leave their links as well if you want to look to get a good option file. And also, I'm playing on PC. You might see like the Xbox buttons, like where it says confirm and everything like that. Switch tabs, LB and RB. I'm just using a, a controller because uh, I don't really like playing with the keyboard. So that's why it shows like that. But this is, this will be uh, like PC gameplay. And if you really enjoy this, um, Pez 2019 and want to see... Uh, become a legend series let me let me know but first we're going to get into master league it says take control over your club on and off the pitch become the world's most successful club by winning domestic and international silverware so let's get into it So right there, I really loved that intro. Like, again, something, could this be better than career mode? Is this better than career mode? It'll be in FIFA 19. That was a great little intro. Uh, I know I can just imagine how it'll be <laughs> in FIFA, uh, like telling you the new trances, whatever. So, club operate. okay, here we go, club operations. Let's see what this is. Again, if this is the in Pez previously, uh, again, let's just say last couple years I haven't played Pez, but see, this is a new thing to me. So as a viewer, uh, my subscribers, you guys m m will be interested to see something new for me at least. But anyway, uh, you can now choose between, I guess it's new if it says you can now choose between classic and challenge mode. I think I want to just play classic normal for now, but challenge mode could be interesting. It says in challenge mode, you can expect to run into more obstacles in managing your squad. I feel like I'd want to do it like as a challenge save, but because I haven't played Pez for a while uh, with a proper master league, yeah, I'll just go classic for now. But yeah, that it's good they added that so it can give you more of a challenge. Again, something unique. FIFA. Th I'm not going to be <laughs> comparing it to FIFA all the time. Just uh, yeah, it's what I am in my head at the moment. So match level. I like to go to the hardest level. Superstar. I mean, just not with Pez, but just in general. I like to go to the hardest level in a game and then just go to the next lot like the next lowest one top player which is still i always that used to be the highest level wasn't it like this is quite a few years back i remember playing on top player and it was pretty hard so but that's what i always like to do with video games start on the second hardest and then progress to the hardest as you go on especially when you're just starting the new game you know what i mean so hopefully that's all right match time 10 minutes that sounds good currency unit yeah use pounds classic players off yeah Again, maybe that could be for a different series. I do. I could. I could do those two together. We play a challenge and some classic players. Right now, we want to use all the players currently playing, and that's another thing as well. Okay, stops during transfer window only when they're in progress. 
we'll leave that for now. What I did want to say is, um, apparently there has been saying like there's not a huge amount of new features compared to last year in Master League, but one thing in terms of the amount of leagues that are added, that add just so many more players you can use and potential signings. And you know in Pez, they always have those talents. You always have those unknown talents and that you sign and become wonder kids all that kind of stuff so we're going to go obviously club team lineup uh, for this series obviously with arsenal so we'll go into that and here guys here you can see there's all the correct see champions league fifa's got the rights some people oh i'm not gonna saying i'm not gonna buy pez because of that but yeah download these updates like i said you can download from pez universe and yeah you can get all that uh, called the premier league uh, every every all the updates and it's all looking good but we are going to get into the premier league and of course guys if you're excited for this if you haven't already make sure you like the video and subscribe if you're new around here uh, a lot of football gaming content on this channel growing 130k subscribers and yeah hopefully going to 150 that's my goal so 150k <laughs> for 130k at the moment but yeah 150k is my goal so subscribe if you haven't yet and help me reach that but guys again obviously we're going to be arsenal but again once more just to show you there's all the real teams in this update so yeah make sure you follow this series uh to take a look more of a closer look if you haven't bought, bought pez and see like what these updates do for you but yeah we are going to be going i'm just it's very interesting how they're sorted it's not like exactly alpha alphabetical order or something but yeah we're gonna go with arsenal and it's updated squads as well when i well, when i downloaded this from steam bought it from steam uh, the updates weren't there <laughs> there was like still like aaron ramsey at arsenal not aaron sorry um I just saw Aaron Ramsey there. It was, you know, Jack Wilshere. Jack Wilshere. Like, there was a lot of... Yeah. But the updates are up now, so I can finally... <laughs> yeah, they're, they're all in, so I can get into this nationality region. So, we are going to go to Australia, because I am, in fact, Australian, if you can't tell. So, we're just going to edit the appearance a little bit. So, I didn't want to spend too much time on that. I used to. I used to when I want to create like a manager or a player or whatever, but yeah, just get the dark slick backed hair and the blue eyes, just a couple things to replicate myself. So yeah, uh, we'll select okay there. I don't really actually try and make managers look like myself. I just, someone that looks like cool or whatever. <laughs> That's what I do. It's not too important though. So let's progress. So there we go. This is the press conference. Oh, that looks pretty solid. That looks pretty solid. Again, this is the stuff in the game previously, in previous, like, last couple years. Uh, but to me, it's new because I haven't played Masterly because, you know, you guys, I, I do the career mode stuff in FIFA. So I normally focus on that. So I I'm, it's this is really new to me, which is a cool thing. Maybe to some of you, it's not new. But, yeah, that's why I'm going to enjoy this. So the club secretary says, let me be the first to congratulate you on taking the helm for Arsenal. But I'm not going to take too much. I'm, I've, I've just selected Arsenal. I didn't, yeah, I didn't really do too much <laughs> so far. I didn't uh, succeed. <laughs> I didn't do too much. But, yeah, I'm the club secretary. Oh, I get another thing. Like, it's already, I'm like not even, I'm like just 10 minutes in or something like that. Uh, into a new game, and this seems more in-depth than career mode is in FIFA. Crazy. You have a secretary. How about that? I'm the club secretary. I can't wait to start working with you. The club staff will make sure... See, more staff as well, man. I'm sold. I'm, like, less excited for FIFA 19 career mode now. I'm like, this has got me already. The club staff will make sure you have all the info... Perfect, yeah. Uh, we're in the transfer window. Well, already in the transfer window. I don't want to progress too far, because you guys might have signings like suggestions or whatever but i do want to play with the majority of the same squad i don't want to make too many changes maybe just a few players so look at their footy manager tv appointed as manager i really like the set out of this the, 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 how it looks it really looks nice our mentality really improved i like these news headlines they look good as well so yeah i'm the newly signed manager let's go into team management you got the game plan. You got training. Let's see what training is. You got youth team training. What is this? What is this? Skill training as well? I just want to take an initial look at this. Um, so, scout here. 
this is where you designate the abilities. So these are things I'm going to focus on a little bit more. I like how you have descriptions, not of the position they are, but actually the type of role they play. You've got, you've got whole player with Aaron Ramsey. Aaron Ramsey, I've always liked him. And you've got level, like, of the team roles. Like, mate, this is... I'm... Man, I'm, I'm loving this already. I haven't even played a match. <laughs> you got the goal poachers there, and big reason why I wanted to go with Arsenal. Oh, you got Lacazette. Obviously, Welbeck, but... Or Bemiang and Lacazette. We're just going to have a lot of fun with them. One of them, though, Carl Jenkins is one I said, maybe I'll transfer list, or maybe I'll try and sell. But this is all for the train. This is more in-depth training than football manager is. Any football game, Pez has got, like, I've got to, I've got to take a bit of time. You might see that more in the next episode. Right now, it's a bit too much to take in while I'm recording uh, live. I've got to think about it for a bit. But yeah, the training looks good. So again, if you go back to team management, don't need to edit numbers. If we go to negotiations, we'll see the game plan as well. Just go yes. Um, see, I might. Hmm, you could weigh up. Do you want to play something a bit more uh, like their style, like a four-two-three-one, or do you play like? For me, Lacazette starting on the subs bench, like, to me, you drop Iwobi, you bring on Lacazette is a better kind of option to me. But that's something we're going to experiment uh, more with. And we won't worry about too much now, but let me know. I want to, I do want to play this in the way that you guys will enjoy it as well. And you can see the manager there, he's, I don't know, I look a bit flustered at the moment. <laughs> the the mentality's improved and I've just joined. I'm just trying to point out everything right now. But... Yeah, if we do actually go into negotiations, I will say that. So, oh, sports director. Whew. How about that? You can see our transfer budget there. We've got about 40 million. You've got our salary budget. That's looking pretty good. So, yeah, the sports director, he says, the only thing I could complain about that or could say it could be improved, that it's like a blank face. But, hey, uh, we have two budgets at our disposal transfer. I can kind of, yeah, understand what it says there. Yeah. That's kind of been in the game. I remember I played, I think where, when I played it a lot last was maybe around Pez 2016. Last year, last few years haven't played so much. So you got the youth. Do we have any youth players yet? Uh, there's players in our youth team. You can, I remember this. So let's see. Is there, you got the market value in the first. Okay. The OPR is the overall. And we've got a few decent, decent players. Can we sort them Let's just go to the top. Yeah, here we go. Category, overall rating. So, our highest is Harrington. Harrington looks like the best player. Does it show, does it show age at all? There's a lot of options. <laughs> so, you can see the different kind of players. It goes, okay, he's 20 though. For me, 67 overall for 20 years old. See, to me, McDowell looks the best out of the ones I've shown already. But considering his age, there wouldn't be too many lower. There's 16, okay, uh, Texera. Let me know. Let me know, you guys. Would any of these players become good enough? But, yeah, to me, like a 17-year-old, 66, 16-year-old, 65. I'm not going to make any moves permanently right now. But, yeah, let me know what you think about those lads. And who, let's see, Harrington, when I say he's 20, kind of goes lower in the pecking order. His potential may not be as high. So, yeah, keep all that in mind. Like I said, McDowell probably strikes me the most right now, uh, considering he's only 17. He's got some in the 70s, his attributes. So, yeah, he could be one that's trained up. He can play like right back, uh, potentially right midfield as well. He's got the long throw for player skills, comp playing styles, uh, early cross long ball expert. So here we are. Look how depth he's got personality. He's a lone wolf. Like, if you play Pez a lot and you're wondering why I'm going so... Because I'm a career mode player. I'm a career mode player in FIFA. And that's why I'm so shocked. And these are probably... Oh, yeah. These are all right features in the game and everything like that. And even if they were in the game previously. But I'm just... This... Ah, oh, it's already... Like... <laughs> like FIFA, you're left in the dirt. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm so excited uh, because I love my favorite game was Pez Six on PS2. I'm sure many uh, Pez players would agree with that, or many people, even if you play FIFA. But anyway, see, this is so in depth already, guys. I like to go in depth with my videos. If you're wondering, as I'll not rush too much, especially this is like some people watching, uh, maybe to see how the game is. So yeah, I do want to keep it like that. But once more. Uh, we're going to check out. Uh, this guy doesn't look too bad. I know he is a young player. He's only 19. 
Yeah, he's got... I love players with passion, so he's got that. Well, th yeah. All those arrows are aiming down, but anyway. You can see the growth... I like those, like, growth sheet. The development sheet. That looks pretty good. But I think Carl Jenkinson, because he is a bit older, he's 26, he's not going to improve. So we can just test selling... There's... Yeah, there's Mavropanos as well. Maybe Martinez. Maybe just leave him as, <laughs> like, third keeper. But for the guy who most likely to sell out of a, like anyone in the team, the best option. So there's transfer policy there. I just want to see what says there. Oh yeah, you can make your options, place on the transfer list and all that. Not on the loan list, open to reasonable offers, only accept, oh well, that's like, nah, I want to kind of <laughs> judge them myself. Place on the transfer list. Yeah, we're going to do that. Club making are open to offers. Okay, yeah, I'm open to offers. Refusal <laughs> is the other option. So we're going to, we're going to go with that. Yep. Add to listed players. In case that didn't work already. <laughs> In ca let me know if it does that. If you place him on the transfer list, is it the same as listed players? Like, do you have to do that? But like I said, guys, I'm not going to go out to try and search for players. Or you can see advanced search. Uh, if we want to. If you want to see, like, young talents or something. Maybe we'll put maximum age 18. Be realistic <laughs> for Arsenal. We'll get some younger players in. If we want to get an overall rating, uh, let's see. Could there be any seven? Uh, I'm trying to. I'm not sure. It will be 75. And I like how Pez has the random maximum rating of 109. So yeah, there's a few. I thought I was right in the ballpark there. So chances of signing i like how it has that session i feel quite a few could be uh recommending that in the comments because i've got him in the past in my career mode series uh how about junior from real madrid probably well, i'm surprised he's that made as that realistic of a signing uh for real madrid at that age i wouldn't expect they'll be willing to sell but uh, then is Paulinho by Leverkusen. But yeah, I feel Sessegnon could be a move. Let me know. He can play all down that left side. Uh, <laughs> I feel like he's more like a left winger now. You start a left back. So, because I've, you can request the... Ooh, a loan. Let me know if we should loan him. He can add team role effect. But right now, we're just going to get him on the list. Red, see, this is another listed player. We've got we've added the player to the list, <laughs> one to the transfer list or <laughs> the short list. I'll see what that is, but yeah, uh, Texa. Oh, these are from these. They still have these, obviously Pez Uniteds and all that. I'm gonna stay away from those kind of players, but <laughs> man, like <laughs> they look good. <laughs> they look good ratings. So, like I said, I didn't want to get into that too much, but I did want to show you what it looks like at least, and you can get the scouting instructions. Okay, but I don't know who we're looking for right now bolster weak spots i just yeah taking a look at this scouting okay enable area consider i just want to leave that for now you can add some more instructions or yeah i just want to leave it for now like i said guys i just want to uh, get through we'll forward some time but i did want there could be a bit more that i didn't even check out yet but i did just want to initially do that and we can get into this right now club secretary um yeah this is obviously yeah this was one of the features this was the, one of the features we're up against Befica, Basel and Celtic that this pre-season competition but I've never seen that as a major feature like how it was added to uh, career mode but big prize money hey prize money is important we've got to take it as that at the moment so now that we get a message from the owner that's cool wants to thank me for joining he's got big plans uh, that's pretty good and oh we expect a bonus if we win the cup I did want to get into a match, so it's a good there's an early one, so we can get essentially straight into that. But I, oh man, I did want to experiment with two strikers. So I think we're going to change this 4-4-2 now. Uh, I just think we can, or it could be otherwise seen as a 4 triple 2 I feel we can have a pretty good formation. Again, I'm not going to take a look too much into specific tactics. I still feel they'll suit the style I'm playing. So let's check, take a look at the team shit. And look, you got Ozil, like... Awobi. I don't know what they were thinking by the default starting 11, but then you got Ramsey. I feel we're going to have to start ahead for this, like, ahead of this younger guy, but I think he's going to have some good potential. And you can right click from trade, then uh, Jacka. I like to choose their best role with their highest rating. 
You got Torreira's. Uh, Torreira's very good, but yeah, we'll leave we'll leave him. But yeah, like I said, Lacazette has to be starting. Has to be starting there. And I would say maybe our squad isn't that huge. Like they're missing some of the actual youth players at Arsenal. That's the only thing I'm thinking right now. Uh, what are your guys' thoughts on that? And everyone else is looking all right. I'm just going to. Oh, Koscielny. I'm going to bring Koscielny for Mustafi. Uh, higher rating, just a higher rating. And of course, yeah, Leno, good goalkeeper. Petr Cech's had a great career, but yeah, bringing Leno there. Uh, looks like, yeah, Lacazette. We're going to have to play him centre forward as well. Uh, Ozil, ooh, not his best role, not his best role. So if we think about Mikatarian, he's good there, right midfield. If we... Player details. I know it doesn't really say it at the bottom if we can. Maybe it's just because this what this formation is. But I remember being. Oh yeah, wait. Yeah, you hold down. See, that's pretty cool how you can do that. Okay, how can he be? Okay, I want to see the first because I still want him to be wide, but so he can still uh, be an AMF like attacking midfielder. That's not bad because it still looks fairly balanced the the lineup there so i like the look of that i think we'll roll like that 11 looks more stronger now like let me know if it looks better even though it's a different formation uh let me know what you think of that lineup and again we'll probably look more into the tactics uh, tactics wise but oh there's coach mode you skip match we're not going to skip uh we're just going to go to next match we're going to get into play it. Ah, uh, yeah. So let's just head into the kickoff now. Team is looking strong. Let's get into it. International Championship Cup Asia. Champions Cup Asia. Ooh, team spirit as well. Like, yeah, I'm loving this already. I haven't even got into, like, the first preseason match. And I'm, yeah, enjoying this so much. Welcome to you all as our coverage of the opening fixture of the International Champions Cup gets underway. It is a slightly new concept for some of you, but it is a special invitation event held both stateside and in Asia, as it has been since 2013. Interest in the competition has been phenomenal. It has drawn in crowds of over 100,000, which signal again that football is indeed a worldwide sport. It presents a rare opportunity for fans who cannot travel to watch their clubs or their favourite players to see them right on their own doorstep. And this must be amongst the favoured arenas of supporters all over the world. It really does have a very special feel to it. Peter, as you have intimated... Really like the presentation so far. Looking really good, but yeah, let's get into this. And like I said, I am playing on PC, so if you notice... Do you notice the quality of it? I uh, know, for me so far, the quality is good. Seems the same quality as for me, Xbox One player, so... Yeah, it's pretty good. And I think for the next game, I'll change it so we can have the players' names on their heads. I think you have to change it in the settings, not in the game settings. I'm not sure. Like, during the match, you can't. Because I checked for a second. Here we go. It's really tight marking. Can't rush it too much, though. Ooh. And I don't know too much of the skills in Pez. Currently, I don't know if there's new ones. Because I know it's different to FIFA. Not just flicking the stick. Oh, good tackle that was. Or Bemiang. Ah, I, got, I know. <laughs> Gotta be quicker. Gotta be quicker. That's why right. I didn't want to go on the exactly hardest level from the start. Oh, but look at that interception. Oh, pass was a bit heavy. Oh, 
Only played a couple games on the demo as well. Just wanted to get into the real thing. Here we go. Got to win this. We do head it down. Can we hit him on the counter? Ooh. Through ball couldn't quite work. But really liking the gameplay so far. Good tackle. Good tackle. Oh, more interception there. Oh, got a lot of space. Easy save. It was going wide anyway, I think. Okay, let's build this up. Just stay, I'm just staying focused here so they don't score. But just hopefully they won't. Got to win that. It was pretty easy. And hopefully the audio is alright guys. Um, I don't generally call, record on PC or a game that has sound. I record Football Manager but yeah, we don't really use the sound on that. So yeah hopefully that's alright. Here we go. Oh, that's not bad. Try to cross. Morel. No. Oh. The footwork. The turn. Oh. I need a kick feint, apparently. Wasn't too bad. But it didn't real. I don't. I didn't feel like it worked. <laughs> I don't feel I should have unlocked that. We've got points for it. Ah, uh, again. Good positioning. Okay, could we try and get a goal? Oh, look at the build-up. Monreal, could he get a good cross in? Oh, mm, weak header. Pretty disappointed with that, honestly. Yeah, yeah. I thought I thought I did better. Come on, try and win this. Again, since I got the header, I d didn't feel like I got the header, to be honest. Oh no, that's a great cross. Whew. I brought out the keeper. I was pressing a few buttons. <laughs> now Ozil. Haven't gone through him much yet. Try and get him into the game. Pfft, not with a pass like that, though. Okay, go quick. Maybe this is what we need to do here. Ah, too slow on the turn, Mikatarian. Good tackle. It's close to half time now. And there we go, that's the half time whistle. Had maybe, yeah, half chance there where I got that kick feint. Pressure. Oh, he almost went out. Oh, what a slight tackle. <laughs> My first slight tackle. 
I always am ca careful with those. Oh, close. Salvio. Okay, oh. They might work it out. No, they don't. No, oh, again. Yeah, good height on that. Come on. Use the width. Let's build something. Come on. Need some width, Matt. Ugh. I'm pretty, ha pretty happy to get a corner with that, to be honest. Okay, yep. See, <laughs> first corner. Let's try and get one in. The power is not too bad on it. Ooh. Damn. Come on, got to get to this. Socrates. He gets to it. Now Monreal. Whipping a ball, which is not too bad. Oh. Couple half chances. I can feel a goal coming. Getting oh, that was good interception. To be fair, <laughs> but I feel our chances are coming more clear as the match goes on. I can see a goal being scored. And it's good to work on this in the preseason, obviously. Get a few games in before the proper the season proper. Oh, good interception. Here we go. Quick. Kantar got to be quick at the passes. We get a free kick there. Well won. Okay, I just want to go short pass at the moment. Alex Grimaldo. I like the stat there. Looks pretty good. How they show that. And here we go. He's Ballerin. Oh, whipped in. Oh, just missed the feet. It was a dangerous one. Oh, come on. Come on. Call it. Oh, Socrat. Oh, my God, he's really doing it. Now he's going to whip one. Oh. I'm telling you, we're getting close. And they're sitting back fairly. Like, everyone... Oh, no, 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 no. I definitely didn't aim it that way. <laughs> but it's okay. Oh, interception. Ozil. Play it through. Ah. He wasn't on the same mind. Or on the same page. Ah. Not sure we ever made subs. I'm not sure. Because I thought this is the strongest team for me, so I want to get a lead. And it's Salvio. Forward it goes. There are a few waiting for it. Yeah, good little tackle, good little tackle. Will we coming? Oh, yeah, it was coming short there. But will it come to anything? They're just keeping possession. Maybe they're happy to get the draw. Oh, well but we're going to get possession. Come on, Ramsey. Play the ball. Here we go. Uh, I kind of get how the through balls need to be now, Pez. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, well, how come the, the headers don't... Oh, they lack a bit of power behind them. They're too placed. From the couple headers we've hit so far. That's all I can judge. They don't put enough power in it. That's just what I can judge so far. It's like a more controlled shot. Like a normal shot. It's like they control it. Instead of just getting that power behind it. I'm scared to hold it too long. Because they were true chances for us. A couple of the best for the game. Yeah, a couple of the better chances, so... The balls have got in from crosses. The headers need more conviction. And accuracy too. But, mm, late in the game. Defensive line, I tried to go more attacking. 
and go, <laughs> it says defensive line control. Oh, great defending. That needed to How you would change the mentality in Benfica FIFA. Showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources. Now. Let me know how you go about it in Pez to go more attacking. Or do you have to go to the settings for your tactics? Rafa Silva is making a foray down the right. But nah, I think we I think we could have scored. Could have slash should have. Come on! Oh, is that going to have? Or oh, thought maybe we would have had too much on it. The control control wasn't the greatest there. Or Bemiang. Oh, come on! Got to take a shot. I took a shot there. If you saw the power go up, but he was too close. It's going to be it though. I re good game. Good game. I really enjoyed it. Oh, I was that last chance there. I knew if I move how I did it there, I, if I could get a shot away, but I, if I took it early, I would have been blocked. I need to create some space. But, yeah, um, encouraging performance, I think. Maybe to you guys, and I'll edit it down, but uh, I feel we could have scored, especially, I think that second headed shot. Ah, like I said, just lack conviction. Uh, Salty get a 3-1 win there, so... Hopefully we can, because I had played a demo match that ended nil-nil as well. So hopefully we can start scoring. But it's good that it's not easy to score. So there, nothing happened in the couple days. Ooh, what's this? Playmaker, Aaron Ramsey. Like, <laughs> what are they telling us? Is something going to happen here? This is, uh, oh, he's new team. Oh, man, that's so cool, though. That's so cool. He gets a new role. Building a team around. I just want to make sure I read this. Okay. It's really cool. That's really cool. I think that will be a fitting way to finish off this episode, guys. First episode. Pez Master League. Oh. The only thing, again, just the gameplay. We're going to hopefully score some goals, but I'm loving how Pez looks, guys. So expect to see much more episodes. I'm going to try and get an episode out every single day. And if you guys yeah, show that great support, I want to push to do two episodes, two episodes every single day. So uh, yeah, make sure you leave a thumbs up. Share with your friends who like Pez as well. Even guys who like career mode in FIFA. Yeah, try playing this. But yeah, take a look at my series. Hopefully you enjoy it. And I'll catch you guys in the very next episode.